being in the hair shows have put me where I am today. I'm, today I cut uh, celebrities when they come to town. Uh, I cut such people as Floyd Mayweather, Jill Scott, um, Mike Tyson, his whole camp. Uh, back in the day, we used to cut Big Daddy Kane. It was all because of just of, of, of putting back into what what was given to me. Naaman Mitchell, Master Barber, over 20 years. Uh, been involved with Golden Scissors since the inception. Uh, today I'm here with Glenn basically to take part in the restoration pro uh, program. A restoration program is where we actually help young students um, perfect their craft so far as barbering is concerned. Uh, one of the things that we will be doing for the show, I want everybody to sit back, hold tight, because we will be participating in the um, Total Look competition, and I'm looking forward to having a great time. Uh, what i like for everyone to know is that if you want to build your brand, build your name, you have to get involved, you have to take part in any show, all shows, basically Golden Scissors is one of the best shows that I would say to take part in. Um, always, always be ready to compete. Uh, one writer said that you should never, um, that you should always be ready so you don't have to get ready. So any opportunity that presents itself for you to market your name, market your brand, market your, 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 your craftsmanship, you should actually be involved in. Say that I didn't gone down, I didn't did my thing down here, right? When I get halfway, this is about halfway, right. you should go on and start walking. Okay, so as soon as she leaves that point. Okay, as soon as she leaves, then I stand right yeah, here. Right, gotcha. right, 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 right. But when you come on, we still come back to this point. Come on right. back. Yep. So we she's come down to here. Oh, and that's fine. If, she's, if there's somebody here, you just say, come on and stand beside him. Give him a little wink, give him a little eye. Yeah, I like that. Okay. My name is Angelo Cannon, and um, I come to enter the, the 20th Annual uh, Golden Scissors Award. I was in the first one. I was in a couple of the other ones. I won a few. I just was guided to the Golden Scissors Award to come in and enter again this year. Um, to put my name back out there to help the young people and, uh, and also help myself. And, uh, and entering the show is, is a great way of, of, of building a clientele because it, it shows uh, you know, that I'm, I'm, I'm interested in, in something else besides being selfish for me. My, I come here to, to, to help, the, help the youth and support Glenn and, um, and, to, and to give back. I appreciate you. I value you. Uh, I, I heard about your great show that you did in Hagerstown. The difference is Golden Scissors represent who you are. That's what this brand is. It embraces the kind of cultural diversity, transgender, and everything else you can think of in this umbrella we embrace here. So this is where you, you shine. So some of those non-motivated people that you have in your school that are not motivated, that didn't go to Hagerstown, they live here. They should at least come and support and show the imp impact of this school because what you're doing is amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, you're the real authentic Golden Scissors hair show presentation because we've done this for 20 years. So if you see these people, they ain't doing nothing but walking. They're not even doing routine. Mm -hmm. So here you are. This is what hair shows represent, and y'all the meat and potatoes. I've been cutting hair 33 years, and I've, I've met a host of, of good friends and. Uh, and I just enjoy what I do. I just enjoy the craft of Barbara. That I have to sell tickets. I have to have someone here to support me. Like I was like for the for the uh, the DMV Best Barber contest. I understand. I had to have people go in there and vote for me. And, and those are the people I can sell tickets to and come out and enjoy the show, so that it can keep going. If if you don't put nothing in it, and, and we're not gonna get anything out of it. Andrew and I have been friends for uh, quite some time. Several years, I'd say almost 20 some years. And, uh, exactly, as a matter of fact, we've been friends for 20 years um, this year. We've really? been friends since 1991. 20 years this year. 20 years this year, so isn't that interesting? Both of us in the hand show together. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs>